We just got through the launch of GPT-4 a few days ago, and now we have Copilot from Microsoft. We're gonna go through the features and do a few quick tests to see how Copilot performs in the very limited live demo that is available to us. But first, let's get access to it. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. As of right now, Microsoft has said that Copilot is not available to everyone and will be rolled out in stages with priority given to the web edition rather than the installed edition on computers and laptops. If you do get access though, the way to find that out is go to your Word, Excel, PowerPoint software and on the home screen, you should see within the ribbon, this icon. If you see that icon, you have access to Copilot. But as you can see from my screen, I don't have that access as of right now. With that being said though, we are gonna use a way to be able to get access to the early edition, and this is how. Getting access to the preview version of Copilot is not difficult. Go to this link provided by Microsoft, and you'll have two options to select from. In our case, we're gonna select option number two, which is your organization doesn't use Business Central. Five steps to follow, pretty straightforward like any sign up process. It does not require any form of payment or dedication or commitment. The important part to remember is that when you go to the country or region, be sure to select United States. Otherwise, your trial might not function properly with regards to the co pilot. Once all the steps are followed, we should see the home screen with Cronus USA Incorporated as a fictitious company that we can play around with. And most importantly, we see step number five in the checklist create with co pilot. That is what we want to use and test out. Before we get started with our demo, it's important to note that the cool examples of creating product write-ups and budget proposal, PowerPoint presentations, or even analyzing Excel data with Copilot are not yet available for the public. So we'll make do with the limited edition and demo available to us in Dynamics and use a fun example to see how the Copilot performs with something that we provided. Let's do that. To access Copilot, we're going to click on items on the home screen, and that will lead us to a page with all the products or marketing items that they have available for testing. Now, if you want to test something from Microsoft themselves in the stummy data that's provided, you can click on one of these, but that's kind of boring. So we'll go ahead and create an item, which I've already done, and show you how you can use Copilot to create some marketing text. Here's our item, the great and amazing rusty truck. Now this applies for any item. You'll see the details of the product or the item itself. And on the right side here, we have the marketing text and the magic of the Copilot that we can play around with. So by clicking on create with Copilot, we can create some text that's related to marketing of this item. But if you click on edit, you can customize it further with format and length where you can make it brief, paragraph, tagline, so on and so forth. And you can also click on more settings to be able to select the tone of voice that would be upbeat, casual, formal, and some other options. You can also select to emphasize a certain quality of the item and that way we'll generate the text. So in our case, we'll select upbeat tagline plus paragraph and ask it to generate or create a draft. Well, let's test out what it wrote down for us. Turn rust into trust with rusty truck. Rusty truck represents a unique opportunity for those looking for a challenge. With some elbow grease and a little bit of creativity, you can transform this old and ugly truck into something truly special. It may not have a working engine, and it may have mold growing on the seats, but with the right vision and dedication, you can make Rusty Truck into a new treasure. Assemble it to your own design and specifications, and you'll be the proud owner of a one-of-a-kind vehicle. Rusty Truck is not just a parts category. It's a chance to use your skills and imagination to create something that will last for years to come. Get out there and get started. I don't know about you, but that's pretty good, man. I think it's, it's kind of funny, it's interesting, and this is the first iteration. Now, the last use case, which is based off of Microsoft Copilot itself, I took a fictitious item, added it to the list, added some attributes to it, and normally what we can do, as you've just seen, is add some marketing text to it with Copilot. However, in this case, I'll go to edit, and then change the tone and the way this is done, make it upbeat, interesting, or rather, let's make it creative, and we'll go ahead and emphasize the quality, innovation, generate the text, but I'll add my own element to it and see what it comes up with. So let's create draft and read out what it comes up with. Once the text is generated by the AI, we take it, customize it behind the scenes, and come up with the final product, which looks something like this. Let's read through it and see what it feels like. Copilot, taking AI to a whole new level of assistance. Microsoft Copilot is the newest and most innovative AI assistant, but you can't use it yet. Why, you ask? Well, we say, why not? The demand is high and there is no supply. But don't worry, you'll wait anyway, because what else can you do? Whether it's helping you with work tasks or providing you with personalized reminders, Microsoft Copilot has the power to make your life easier. 
It's no wonder that Google had a Code Red meeting, and perhaps there is some panic over at Google. But don't worry, they can always use Microsoft Copilot to help. Copilot, the only thing missing is the actual product. Coming sooner than you think, but later than you want. Stay tuned.